If I lived it all This is a DC Anime Review. This is Christina speaking. We're going to be discussing Season 4, Part 2, Episode 6, and joining me is Poonja and Doreen. Anime only as you have no chance of avoiding spoilers. I'm sorry. That's, that's, that's my contribution to this podcast. <laughs> you guys are already lost. You, you guys are screwed. Literally screwed because the rumbling has begun and... Oh boy. Yes. Oof. Yeah. Aaron, you wow. selfish bastard. <laughs> You're the best <laughs> for being wow. selfish and murdering everyone. No, he is being selfish. He is, I know. I'm only kidding. He's being selfish, like, because it's crazy, because... He's, da- now- he's damning the entire world into obliteration just for the island. I mean, I understand that. You care about, yes, your, but- you care about, you care about your friends. I understand that, but... Seriously, what the fuck did the world do to you? The world hasn't done anything to you yet. Marley has done shit. I understand that. Yeah, you can destroy Marley all you want. Go ahead. Mm-hmm. But the entire yeah. world, what did the world do to you? Nothing. Yeah, uh, no. the, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, because Aaron, like, I understand his idea of, like, he feel like that people were like, oh, you know, they don't care about his people and everything like that. But the problem is that what he's doing is wrong. Like, he's killing humanity. He's killing, like... Yeah, he's doing complete genocide. Genocide, definitely. Doing. It, is, it, is ge- it is genocide, and I'm like... Yeah, you're mad at everybody for what it, what's happened to you. I get that, but it's like... This is but, not the right way to go about it. Even, even we'll get to that part when we discuss, like, with Gabby. But even mm-hmm. she said it. She's like, just destroy, you know... The armies, like, just destroy all the armies, not the people. Yeah, the he, people had nothing to do with anything. Yeah, the innocent, all the innocent people did not, had nothing to do it's of kind of, what happened to, which has happened, you know? Exactly, I mean, it's kind of like how I see how the world is today, too. Like, how we feel like we start wars and everything, but the people had nothing to do with starting all no, these... No, absolutely uh, not, absolutely not, that's why... I keep saying with these podcasts, with Marley, everybody hating Gabby, everybody hating Reiner, everybody hating Annie, everybody hating Bertolt, did they had no choice. They had mm. absolutely no choice in what they did and what they had to do. It was either you do your job or you're dead. Exactly. Exactly. It's it's the same thing. Like you start, you, you know, you do what's right. You serve your country, or, and you know, and that's it. Same thing. No, like, but they didn't really have a choice, and you're right, they didn't have a choice. They, they were, they were, um, they're pretty much each one of them. They were all brainwashed, thinking that each side is the the worst, is the bad side. Yeah, especially, especially, not. especially, you know, in Mar- with Marley and you know, with all the warrior candidates, and they're thinking, oh, the people on the island are devils; they're the evil people. No, and then, and then that's why Reiner's head is so fucked up is because he's been with these people for you know a certain amount of years i think it was four years or whatever that's why Mm -hmm. his head is so fucked up like that's Mm -hmm. why he can't think straight anymore that's why he's suicidal that's why because he thought all these people on the island they're evil people and they deserve to die but then you know he spent time with them he became friends with these people that's what Mm -hmm. gabby's going through right now yeah especially was gabby going through like she just she's starting to realize like the mistakes that she made like that she thought they were evil and and it's not the case they're not evil you know they're not and now she feel like maybe maybe it wasn't them who's the devil I'm actually the devil because of what I did you know what I did because she killed Sasha and she tried to repent for her sin and for her to go and protect Sasha's fam- family, Sa- yeah, and Kaya. Sasha's family. Kaya, Kaya, yes, especially Kaya. And Kaya was like, the strangest, at that moment, she was like, 
Gabby just remind her of Sasha. Yeah. Right there, that moment, protecting her. Like, her big sister came back for her to protect her from the Titans. Like, all deja vu again. Like, it's mm -hmm. kind of interesting how... And she didn't get it. Like, okay, why did Gabby risk her life to say me when I tried to kill her for what she did to Sasha. Like, I yeah, do not like she's get supposed that. to be, yeah, because, like, she's supposed to be bad. She's supposed to be wicked. She she killed my, you know, she killed my sister, so. And mm -hmm. meantime, she's going around turning the, story, the, the whole thing around and protecting her. Mm -hmm. So, that means, like, you know, just because something, one thing happens doesn't mean that you can't see... What the, the other person, you know, the other person's point of view, where they're coming yeah. from, exactly. exactly. And it's like they're kind of learning from each each other perspective that they're not as evil as they seem. But it's just like we um. But it was interesting how who was it um Sasha the one that he was in love with Sasha Nicola. was that the one N Nicola. Nicola? It was interesting how Nicola said it. That we all have double inside. He's we not all... wrong. It's true. Even even Kenny said the same thing. Everyone's drunk to something. It's... He did say I mean, that when he died. That, you know, he, it's it, true, and it's true. He did. Yes. It's very mm -hmm. true. And uh, he's trying, in a way, that we all make mistakes. Exactly. I think that's what it's trying to realize that we're not. We're human. We're we not are, perfect. We're not perfect. We're not perfect. We make a mistake. We do. We. And then we try to fix our mistakes. When we realize what we did was wrong, we we'll try to fix our mistakes. And it was interesting. It was, you know, and it's interesting that Kaya, when, when those so, when the soldiers saw that they thought, oh, okay, that's Gabby. Um, she's the invader and everything. They were gonna take her. Or they were gonna capture her. Most likely her. kill her. Like, most or likely kill, kill her. her really. And like, and like even too, like even with Aaron. Okay. Like, everyone right now, they think he's, like, the bad guy, probably, or the villain, and... He is the bad guy. That's not... At not the moment. really. Not really. If you think about it, it's just that he feels he's doing the right thing. Yeah, that's in his head. Just, it's in, in, his. in his head. It's, this is just... Yeah, that's... Aaron believes that this is justice. This is what everybody deserves because, you know, the world is cruel in his eyes. Mm -hmm. exactly. exactly. So, technically, in his head... So if you think about it, in his head he feels that it's I'm doing I'm doing the right thing. It might be wrong. Mm -hmm. I'm going to I want to do what I can. I'm going to do whatever it takes to have this world be a better place. Mm -hmm. And even if I have to go and kill everyone off of it of the yeah. earth just to get my point across mm -hmm. that I don't think but I don't feel like I'm doing the wrong thing. No. Yeah, but, but course, I mean, to once... us, but to us, the viewers, we're like, "What the hell is wrong with you?" You know? Yeah. yeah. And to us, we feel like he's being—he's genocizing everybody, and that uh, he's becoming like this monster. And and to him, he doesn't see that. To him, mm -hmm. he feels like he's, he's doing saving the right thing. Everybody. Yeah, he's, he's saving, doing the right no, thing. No, he's no, he's only saving his friends. He's not saving everyone. He's only that's saving I mean. his friends, and that's selfish. Yes. It's it not selfish. it's not selfish because to him in his head yeah. in his brain. It's not selfish but, to him, but exactly. to us and to everybody in this series, it's mm -hmm. selfish. It is selfish, and you know what's funny? That Aaron's friend blame, in a way, blamed himself for that. He's just he's mostly doing. He's just thinking. He's not thinking. He's doing. He's, he's using. He's thinking, acting. Yeah, exactly. He's acting before thinking, but there's consequences when you act before thinking. And oh so, boy, is he gonna have some consequences? And we're not saying nothing about that because those are exactly. spoilers. Exactly. <laughs> so that's why I stop what I'm about to say. I yeah. be quiet about the rest of that. Yeah. But that's pretty much what's going on with Aaron. I and he. It's not the first time that Aaron's done shit. Where without thinking. He, without thinking. Yeah. He's always been, he's been this character since, and, and he's been like this since the beginning of this show. Yeah, every, every, notice, every, everyone's like, everyone's like, very... every, I'm sorry I'm cutting you off, but everyone's like, okay. Aaron's, Aaron's, Aaron's changed, he's different, no. No. This is the same Aaron that you have known, it's just, you know, he's doing things that in your opinion aren't right. Exactly. Well, Aaron just... 
took what he started and just intensified it, you know? Yeah. So yeah. it's just we haven't, we never noticed it, you yeah. know? Like a lot of, we just felt like, okay, he's, he's, he's wants, you know, he wants revenge. He wants to get even, all, all this stuff. And yeah. I mean, he might have things that were, probably, maybe there was things that were, that he changed. He did change. Like every one of them, of course, changed in some sense because a lot of shit that's gone on. Yeah. But, but him with being like his uh, wanting justice and wanting freedom and all this stuff and that's do, always that's it's, always been his goal. That's always been Aaron's goal. Yeah, from the beginning, and yeah. he's just acting on it now. Yep, that's all it is. Yeah, and it's a little by little. Like we didn't notice it until now. Now it start once he started developing his character, you start to see. Like Aaron that we never saw before. Like this is something yeah. like, okay, it's a totally new Aaron. This is not the Aaron from the very beginning of the yes, first. Yes, it season. is. It yes, is. It is. I mean, it is. Aaron. It is the same Aaron. But what I'm trying to say is that Aaron car. It just that uh, he started to become. How can I say this? Like we didn't know that until now. We know he. Yeah, that he. You know what yeah, I mean? because yeah. I mean, he didn't have. He didn't have. You know, the Ymir's you know, the founding Titan's powers before. He didn't have all of her powers before. No, he didn't he's have always all of her. Yeah, but he's always been stubborn. He's always never wanted to listen. He always wants to do his own thing. Yeah. Like, you know, and that's that's a typical thing, you know. You know, I'm not going to say, but that's kind of, that's a little bit of how I kind of, I'm, I'm somewhat like that. I'm not 100% the way he went, but yeah. I'm like, if I they could be very arrogant. If I don't want to do shit, I'm not going to do it. You're right. You can put me to water. I'm not going to drink if I don't want to drink that damn water. Unless I feel like it. Right. Because that's so, what it is. Very stubborn and he's very arrogant about he's it. He's stubborn. So, exactly. Very stubborn. And it's his arrogant. pride. That's another thing. Yeah, this- pride kind of, but not so much. It's more of an arrogant thing. It's more yeah. of, I it's need tr- to do my thing and um and that's it. It's true, yeah. Pride is not one of those uh, things. That maybe is not... a tiny bit, but not too much. What's even worse is that the, even like, you know, he, Aaron, Aaron Fowler, you know, Aaron Goopy's here. The like, Icarus? Yeah, yeah. The, my, the, my, my compadres. <laughs> Your compadres. <laughs> oh, fuck that. Yeah. Because <laughs> it's kind of crazy now because... I don't know. They have like any idea of what's really going on behind Aaron right now. Yeah, because... me. Yeah, I mean, I know we're, we're like jumping ahead from the episode, but meanwhile, Flock is like, "I'm still here. Notice me? No, yeah. fucking shoot him in the face." Yeah, but <laughs> Flock away. Seriously, Flock away. Uh, because uh, the they crazy... had an oppor- they had an opportunity, but they didn't take the window option. Right? I know the, the the window was there. Oh, the, uh, the building was broken. Because... They could have just. Throw him and the colossal titans would have ate him. Nope. <laughs> yes. No. Somehow he miraculously survived. And what's interesting is that he goes tell Elena, like he goes put her point yeah. blank a gun at her. Yeah. Like telling yeah, her. Yeah. Now, 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 Flock is like, look, guys, I'm on your side. Look, see, I'm not with Aaron. I'm with you guys. I'm like, you fucking little coward. Like, you're such a traitor. My God, you're too. You're like a toothpaste yeah. fairy. Backstabbing. He's a because... backstabber. That's all he is. Backstabber. So now... No, he, he just... Flock is just like that guy that, like, whatever whatever side he'll follow that will save his ass, he's gonna yeah. follow. Exactly. Whoever's, like, feel like it's the winning team, he's gonna, like, jump. And if Aaron's winning, he's gonna jump right back to Aaron. And then if, Aaron, if the other team winning, he go jump back to Doug. I, I forgot. Did he... Does he, Well, you know what? I can't spoilers. say. Spoilers! 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 No, we can't say anything. I will be quiet. Yeah. But... <laughs> I will you, say no more. But you was bad, though. Because... Where Elena now she realized that Zeke have no control of the Titans. Yeah, Zeke, now. Zeke, Zeke's taking a nap, and Elena gave up because her man didn't do what she wanted him to do. So he, did, he didn't deliver. <laughs> yeah, exactly. He didn't, yeah. Deliver. he didn't deliver it. Yeah, it was bad. And now that the Titan have that, that Zeke have no control of the Titan. Now the Titan is going whatever they. Like go on this rampage, start. Yeah, well, yeah. Aaron has yeah, zero whatever. control over these colossal titans. 
Yeah, which is interesting. No, I think no, I think he's doing it on purpose. You know, he's like, fuck, uh, do knows? whatever you want. It's true. Maybe he is. Maybe he's not. Who knows? Who we, knows we, what's we, going on? He's, he's relaxing. He's relaxing. He's, he's having, just a, relaxing he's having with a beer. He's, yeah, that's what I'm saying. He's relaxing with Ymir. He, he, he's showing Ymir, you know, that you know the good life, giving her like cookies. Maybe I don't fucking yeah, know. Exactly. Not exactly. those kind of cookies, but like actual <laughs> cookies, food, yeah. snack. Exactly. Yeah. But you know what starts to get really sad now is that because all the Titans were once their comrades, like all of, you know, yeah, Mikasa, Armin, yeah, and everybody. Can we, wait, wait, wait. Can we applaud John for being this awesome boy? Can we applaud John yeah. for taking freaking leadership? I, yes. I, I got to give John right for that. <laughs> Yes, he it's, did. Even though know, it was hard for him to do, it was a challenge for him because you can see. Think, 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 think about it. Hanji's not there. Levi's not there. And John's like, well, I better take the lead and do something. Mm -hmm. Exactly. It's true because somebody has to lead because it's like, what is, like, they can't just hold back. They have to do something. They have to. The team has fallen apart. This is yeah. what happens they, when they you were, drink wine. They were giving up. They were, no, but it was bad, but. Others were kind of like giving up, like they were kind of doubting themselves. Which is, John was, but it's horrible too, because all their plans like just backfired on them. Because yeah. like Zeke yeah. thought he had this plan, he was gonna get his bro to like be on his side, and bro and said, "Hell no, he I'm not being on you." And he's like, "I'm gonna do my own shit," and I'm I'm on a beach with Ymir, and we're just watching everyone go and get perished by Titans. Yeah. And then. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, which that was horrible. Yeah, yes, and, which is and, horrible and, thing. And the survey corps, they're just down to a handful of people. Well, I mean, I mean, they're doing better than the Marley and Army. The Marley and Army is dead. They all got that's that's like that. Zeke, Well, Zeke started this shit, and uh, it's pretty much his fault. Yeah, but that's was messed up now because, because he started. He cried. He made them. Uh, he made them drink some wine. Well, well he I mean, made them drink knew, wine, I mean, then cry. Nobody knew the wine was tampered with. Oh, and let's 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 talk about Sean is showing up like a champ. Yes. Oh, oh he, he pulled a awesome Levi. <laughs> yes. That was cool. That's what happens when Levi is not around. Exactly. Somebody somebody has to take over for him, and I'm glad it was Sean. Is. Yes. That exactly. was impressive. That was pretty impressive. How he came. Yes. Like that entrance was awesome. Yeah, it was yeah. Great... It's, literally, it's literally like how Levi comes in to save the day. <laughs> he came in and, to save the day. Ah, <laughs> uh, that um. Commander, um, Pixis. what was his name? Pixis. Pixis. Yeah, unfortunately, because he became a Titan and there was he had no control. Yeah, there was no Armin basically just you know put him out of his misery kind of thing. It's like when you have to put an animal down. Yeah. Well, After eighty-five years, best girl is back. Annie's back. Oh yes. Oh yes. Annie came out of the crystal, like out of the crystal form. She, yeah. She, Popped out of the crystal. She got, they melt. Uh, Aaron used his um, heat ray and melted her. No, out no, no, no they took no, a blow dryer. Because, no, it's because of the rumbling and, and the, when the rumbling happened, like like Gabby, like Reiner was saying that he can't use his armor for the armor titan because it's gone now because of the rumbling, and that's what happened with her crystal. It shattered. Yeah. And this I, girl is gonna be so fucking confused. Yeah, because she was in the slumber. She was in a, a deep sleep for. How long Thousands was it? Like years. more than four years. Uh, show show wise, it was. It's been maybe five years. Hour yes. hour like season one, it's been nine years. Oh my god! It's like forever. <laughs> yeah. That thing. She is that poor girl. She never. She she only had like one season, and then yeah. they they they, they make her come back, and she's like she's on the like final season. Final season. Yeah, it's driving know, she, nuts. Okay, I have a question. I, 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 I want to know who's going to tell her Bertolt's gone. Um, <laughs> let's think. I guess That's Armin. I, I'm Armin. pretty sure Armin probably told her anyway. Well, how messed up you're going to say to Annie, Hey, by just the way, you know, your I ate gone. the guy. <laughs> I ate someone who liked you in the past. Yeah, so well, I, I mean, I mean, I mean she, he, he, she, he wasn't really her boyfriend, but like he liked her. I know he liked it. That's what I'm saying. The one who had, who had a crush on you, I ate him. Yeah. And now I have part of his memory. Yeah, I mean, I'm pretty sure she knows. In me. I mean, so I don't knows. know if I'm getting mixed feelings. 
I'm, yeah. I'm pretty sure she's Dream. knows, because remember, Armin all, always, he kept talking to her in the crystal, so I'm pretty sure she knows. Yeah, even though she couldn't respond back to him, she probably did hear him unconsciously. Yes. Yeah, so yeah, now we can go final thoughts. Okay. Well, right. anyways, this was a, it was a really good episode, and a lot of shit's going to go down, and Aaron's going to do a lot of damage, which he's already done a lot of damage. He's doing damage already. I mean, yeah. He's going to do more damage. Uh, I'm just happy Annie finally came out of prison. And and we're waiting on Levi to recover. So, yeah, you, you know, might, he's you around. Might, you might see Hanji and Levi maybe this week. Yay! Uh, Jury's like, yay! Jury's like, yay! I'm happy. waiting to see Levi. Oh, my God. Like, for the longest I've been. I know. That's the thing. It's like it's it it takes him bazillion and then we always think he's dead, but he's never dead. Listen, so. an anime rules if they don't show the body, they're not dead. Hey, my fun fact that this episode was really good and it was just so messed up though because Aaron is really going beyond genocide. Like uh, like being a maniac about it. But I hope that I hopefully we get to see Levi recovery and everything because I know we had to see him at all. What's going on? And what's happening? But I really did like that. How that like I think that Ga- that Gabby finally start to like re- was repenting for her like her flaws or her, her her sin what she did yeah. and that Kaya I like that she actually protected her. You know, I mean that. Well, yeah, they kinda... I mean, she just saved her life, so. That's what I'm saying. So they kind of help. It's in a way, like they like. It's like a way of forgiveness for to each other. You know, like it's like she forgive her in a way. In a way, like she doesn't forget what she did, but she forgives her. You yeah, know what I mean? And, and Gabby pretty much saved Kaya because you know, Sa- if Sasha was there, she would have done the same. Exactly, and I did like how that turned out like that. Um. I just hope that Fark will be okay because now, right now, Connie just took Fark. Yeah, and so that he could, he could mm-hmm. feed him to her, to his mother. So messed and, up. And he was being selfish too. I'm like, come on. Yeah, he was. Everybody he being was... selfish in today's episode. God damn it. Yeah. So <laughs> hopefully we find out what happened, and hopefully they get they get to save Fark in time before Connie make this Connie make this decision. To get, to feed him to his mother, which Scooby so snacks, <laughs> snack, not Scooby snacks. <laughs> right? no. And overall, this show was really good, and I it's gonna get. I know it's gonna get a lot darker, even more. It's gonna get really bad, now. man. <laughs> anime onlys, you're not ready. And you're not ready. And what? anime onlys, you're not ready. No, you're not ready. You're not ready yeah. for what's to happen. So. Lots of lots of death. I, I mean, I, I wish I wish I could say what it is, but you know, you'll you'll see what happens. But all I'm saying is that you're not ready. And yeah, like you're saying, Doreen, I commend Gabby for her character development and you know the mm-hmm. way she saved Kaya because you know that's Sasha's family. Like the she she wanted to you know do something to like you were saying repent for her sins because she killed Sasha and that was the only way for her to do it. Yeah. And I did like that. I did like how. I mean, that... I'm, I'm, I mean, I'm pretty sure there's gonna be like a, a still. You know, you can you can just hate the character. It's fine. Like we're not mm-hmm. saying we're not we're not saying love Gabby. Like you can still hate her for killing Sasha, but you have to see where she's coming from. She, you think about it. She's a child. She's a child soldier. She's a child soldier that got manipulated by her government. Yeah. Very true. Sure. Exactly. It's, it's so true. And yeah, and Aaron is, he's just going down this wayward, weird path that stuff will happen and he's going to have to, you know, face the consequences eventually, but we're not saying what the consequences are. It's yeah. because those are spoilers. <laughs> yes, exactly. exactly. Like consequences okay. for his actions. Yeah, exactly. they're always consequences. And I, I'm, I'm, I'm glad Anne gets back and hopefully, you know, she has some contribution to this fight. And the Survey Corps did awesome. You know, Jean was awesome. Everybody was awesome when the fight scene was really good. Oh, it was really good. Yes, it was. 
And for that, we'll see you guys for another podcast sometime next week. All right, bye.